All right, guys, this is a video of my 2019 F350 diesel, and I have finally cracked it on how to enable operator commanded regens with Forescan. So as you can see, I already have it enabled. Exhaust filter full, push OK to clean. Took a long time to get it to 98.82, but whatever. So I got all this random stuff open. EGTs are low, it took quite a while to keep it under 300 because I kept trying to activate a regen. So, to activate it, you're gonna go here. Up to here, you're gonna go into PCM, module configuration, and you're gonna push run. And that brings you to here. Axle ratio, DPF manual regeneration. So I've already changed it. So where is my cursor? Right there. So you go to here. Your factory selection will be this. You're gonna change it to this and push okay. You're then gonna go over here and push right. Now, as you can see, there's no changes for me. So I'm not gonna write it. But after that, it will write your new manual regeneration. I'm not sure what the re active regen inhibit does. You can try them both. I've been driving up and down the highway for the last hour trying to get to 100%. So, you can do whichever one you want. There is manual regeneration and there's manual regeneration with active regen inhibit. That's how you do it. I'm going to X out of this, change that. I'm gonna to go to here, clear all that stuff, clear this stuff, what about that? Every time that I screw with this thing, I always go to the dumpster and I dump everything. I know the factory can probably see that I've played with stuff, but it's all good. Anyways, now that that's done, I can clear this log as well. Go down to here, disconnect and pull it out. Truck's a little bit of a mess, but whatever. This is fully factory. All I've done is turn on the manual regeneration. Hold to clean. Is the exhaust pitch position safe? Okay. And you've just started your first manual regeneration. I used to do forced regenerations with Forescan, but my adapter kept kicking me out when I would try, so I opted for this. Gonna see how it goes. It takes about half an hour and an eighth of a tank to a quarter tank of fuel. So just keep that in mind, guys. Thanks.